Hi everyone, a video on using the Alien Flash Transfer Program. I'm going to be using the Alien Flash Transfer Program in Express Mode. Express Mode is the easiest way to use it. You just drag and drop the CRT files into the program icon. First of all I'm going to program one of the Alien Flash's ROM slots with an Easy Flash cartridge image. So we go into Program AF via USB we then go over to the PC. Okay, up in the top right, I have the Alien Flash Transfer Program icon. So I just drag and drop the cartridge image onto the icon. Then starts up. It will ask me which ROM slot I would like to program. I'm going to program ROM slot C. It starts. Okay, as you can see, it also does a verify at the same time it does the program. That Easy Flash cartridge image is a cartridge image with about 30 different playable game demos on it. It's a full 1 megabyte Easy Flash cartridge image, so it'll take between 1 and 2 minutes to program that. If it's the first time you've used your Alien Flash on your PC, it will install the drivers. It'll give you the option of either downloading them from the internet, or otherwise you can point to its location somewhere on your computer. As soon as that gets to the end, it's going to ask us if we'd like to rename that ROM slot. Yes, we will. And we're going to call it Playable Demos. Okay, it's done. We go back over to the 64. We press X. We can then go up to select the ROM slot. Okay, it was ROM slot C that we programmed, playable demos. Okay, this is the compilation I've got of just playable game demos. I'll select one of them. Okay, I'm going to reset. Okay, I'll select another one from our Easy Flash cartridge image.
Okay, we reset. Okay, now I'm going to program the alien flash with an action replay image. So again, we go on to program AF via USB. Then we just again drag and drop. So we grab onto our action replay cartridge image and drop him into the program icon. Okay, it won't take long, only a few seconds. Okay, back over to the 64, we press X, and we go launch AR mode. Okay, there's our action replay. Okay, reset. Okay, another thing we can use on the alien flash is alien load. Alien load is a very easy way to load PRG files over USB. So we go down to Alien Load and we select Alien Download go over to the PC and again we just drag and drop. Okay, just dropping the PRG file onto the program icon it loads Okay, we reset. Okay, we go into alien load again. We select alien download, back over to the PC. Okay, just going to grab a different PRG file. Just drag and drop. Okay, it's loading. Okay, we reset. Okay, now we're going to do a D64 transfer. Okay, we're going to transfer a D64 from the PC over onto a real floppy disk. It's very easy to do. We go to D64 transfer. Okay, it gives us a couple of options. We're going to go from a D64 to a 1541, so we select A. Okay, over to the PC. I've already got a floppy disk in my floppy drive. So we just, again, drag and drop. Okay, that's our D64 image, just dropping them into the program icon. Okay, it's just telling us that it's going to overwrite the floppy disk that we've got in device 8. Okay, it asks us if we want to format it. It's already formatted, so we don't. Okay, it's now writing that D64 image onto the floppy disk. That will take probably about 9 minutes to copy the whole disk. If you've got Jiffy DOS, it'll probably be quite a bit quicker. Thank you very much for watching.